Good morning, happy, wow, is it Wednesday already? It is Wednesday, I think. Okay, so I wanted to get a nine month baby update, nine month vlog for Dove. This month is flying by so fast, and before we know it, she's gonna be 10 months old, and I don't want, I just don't wanna miss all these moments. <laughs> what did you just do? Yay, 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 yay. Dove is now nine months old. Her favorite word is yay, 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 yay. She loves bread. That's her favorite snack. She loves these happy baby creamies. It helps with her pincer grasp, so she's gotten really good with picking up these snacks with just two fingers. She knows hi and bye, and you know mum mum, which is food, time to eat. She's been eating more or less the same, actually still four ounces every couple hours. And that's because we have a really petite girl. She is six percentile on her weight. But the doctor's not worried because she's been on a trajectory, upward trajectory. Her height is about 40 something percentile and her head circumference is like close to 50. She picked these shoes from Journeys. Sid and Osmond got these Crocs for her. Those are some of her favorite shoes right now that she can't fit, so she's just playing with it right now. It is 10, perfectly 10. And she is tired. Time to set her down for her first nap of the day. And usually she sleeps for an hour for this nap. Also, we upgraded to these six months plus passies. There you go. It's time for a nap. this until this is my reality as I'm vlogging but it's 10 36 right now I'm finally having some time to myself to brush my teeth it's not too bad 10 36 but I did wake up at 7 30 beautiful hair we got some campaigns to film and I'm actually so excited about this one because it is with better health better health the app has been so important to me um, I'll talk more about my postpartum mental health Leo set up the room Oh. This is my filming room, my beauty room. Um, I already had my breakfast. I had my two eggs. If you guys have been watching these every single month of vlogs with my baby, I actually have them since the day she was born. You'll know that I love my hard boiled eggs. Came down here because I wanted to show you guys my haul from Aries. You guys know Aries, it's a bra haul. I got my Aerie bag. They make the most comfortable sports bras and I've been obsessed with these underwire bras because my girls need a bit of support. They do make bras that don't have the underwire but these ones are my favorite. I thought I was, when I was in weight and everything, I was um, 36 double D. And then now that I'm nine months postpartum, I'm now a 30, 4C. So this is the not push up one, which I am obsessed with because the lining is nice and like thin. So on days where I want like that natural, I go with this one. I actually can't believe I'm a C. That means I went back to my original boob size, like when I just got my boob job done. This style is the push-up style. It's a little bit more sexy. And this is also the sunny bra. I highly recommend it if you have saggy girls because they make my boobs look so good. This one is a gray one. And also this is a push-up real sunny. It makes me so happy to get good like intimates, comfortable intimates. I think today I'm gonna go with this one. Good afternoon, it's 12.31 and uh, we just woke up from a nap and we're actually napping together. Hey! Hi! hi. Wait, wait, baby girl. Say hi! Baby? Oh Look, she's been doing this when she wants oh to get off. Hi. Oh my goodness. Hi! Cute pie. No, no, don't push me. Okay, we gotta, we gotta change her diaper and then get you fed. She wants to go to you, Leo. Oh, she's just <laughs> laughing. Yeah, every time she sees you, she laughs. Look at she's laughing. Say hi to daddy. Oh. <laughs> hi. Hi, kid. Love you. Oh my god. She thinks you're the funniest person yeah. ever, Leo. Daddy's coming. Hi. <laughs> How are you? You have a good sleep? You slept two hours, huh? <laughs> oh my oh. God. That was rough. 
there we go, sweetie. <laughs> Those little legs are so excited. They're like <laughs> kicking. She's just kicking. Bye! This room is so dark. All right, I'm gonna get her a bottle. All right, kid, at your service. Oh. Okay, look, okay, okay, okay. Come look at you, look at you. Oh yeah, okay. Good girl, baby. That, that was a long stretch of not eating though. Yeah, that's what it she's It went from starving. this morning at eight till now. Oh, oh my God. She's hungry now. About four she's hours? Four hours. Yeah. Don't, no eating, huh? Yeah, I'm hungry too. I only had Boy. two hard boiled eggs. Yeah, hey! Leo here. We just got done with lunch. Now we're gonna get to work. Let's go, let's go, baby. This is a light setup I did. Totally not a fire hazard. You guys, I just finished filming this look for a video that is gonna go live on my YouTube channel. Dev is being such a sweet girl. She's just waiting. And Leo set up this whole thing right here. We're gonna crack, um, get some photos. I feel like it's important to get some photos if we're gonna spend so much time with makeup look, especially as a mama, it's not like this is a luxury. We got some really good ones. Damn, my makeup looks popping in these photos. It is popping. Softer was really nice too. I love this shot. That's nice too, actually, this one. So um, I caught Debbie. I want to show you guys this shirt she's wearing. Mm. It's Kiki's Delivery Service. I got this from Box Lunch. It's the overall, it's so, so cute. And Leo is applying some um, what is this? Soothing massage gel. Soothing massage mm. gel on mm. her. Dove and Leo are heading out to 99 Ranch. I'm gonna load up the kid in the car. Say bye. Say bye bye to the camera. I'm gonna get some work done. I'll see you later. You guys, it's just me and you. Leo, Dove, they are not here right now. I feel like um, this is a, a perfect opportunity to try on some bathing suits that I bought from Shein months ago. By the way, we're inside my filming room. This is where I do my makeup. Talking about my image, body image, and after postpartum, um, I'm nine months in now. So a lot of women that have breastfed, I noticed that their bodies have shrunk a lot back to their pre-pregnancy frame. Um, I didn't breastfeed, so there's still a lot of um, mommy weight on me. And there are times, I'm gonna be honest, where I feel very insecure about it. I think those are the times where I compare myself to other people, um, which is very, very unhealthy. I literally had to stop myself from looking at other moms so that I would stop feeling insecure about my own body because obviously everyone's journey is really different. And I know that my current body type is probably someone's current body type and it doesn't feel good if I feel bad about it. So I'm just trying to love what I have going on. And honestly, I'm, I'm trying to get out of this toxic mind frame uh, to eat a certain diet um, to lose weight. I'm literally just trying to eat that anything that makes me feel healthy, makes me feel happy. Let's just go through the bathing suits because I don't know if I mentioned I got a haircut. Okay, my first impression is that the bra looks a little too small for my boobs. We'll, we'll have to see about that, right? 
Oh wow, these are scandalous. They're so cheeky. Oh my goodness. Why did I choose this? See, this is what happens when you shop late at night and then you forget what you got. Oh, oh wow. Very deep cut. What? Did you guys see this? Oh, oh, this one's cute. Okay. A brown with, um, it's a brown two piece with high waisted top. I can totally see myself wear this. All right, here we have a really safe choice. This is really cute. I can totally see myself wearing this. And it fits so well. Okay, you guys, this is the second one I decided to put on. Whoa, this is scandalous. I think this is too small for my boobs. Like, I definitely can't swim in this. I feel like I can't move without having my nips have a nip slip, but um, does it look sexy? Oh, yes. Am I comfortable? No, not at all. Mom bod in all of its glory. Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah, I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna change out of this now. These are it. Okay, I can totally see myself wearing this. I feel full bodied. Really beautiful, thick mama. I mean, wow. I feel very sexy in this. Like, I can totally see myself wear this. It gave me some coverage. It didn't cover my, you know, my, I thought it was gonna be more high waisted. I was hoping it would go up here and cover my belly button, but it did cover most of the, the mommy looseness that I get down here. And the bra top is a little smaller, but that's okay. When you buy a set, you kind of can't choose. I'm very happy with this set. This makes me feel very confident, very sexy. Like I, I feel very good. Hey, hey girl, what's up? This one is probably my favorite one. Okay, the color is everything. It is, it makes me feel so happy. And I love how tight the top is. So it actually lifts my boobs up. I am now a 34C. I used to be a 32C, 32D, so my band grew one size up. The bottoms are a bit cheeky though, and then you can see my stretch marks. Can you guys see my stretch marks right here? Yeah, I think they look really cute though. I like how this is a true high waist. It covers up my belly, and I, I love this one. I, I wish I got more of this if I had known after trying it on in more different colors because this just fits so well. And I love the little rouge. Is it rouge? Rouge detailing right here. It's so flirty, it's so summery. I love the color. Oh, this is so cute, I love it. And I have a little bit of stretch marks here too. This is actually really therapeutic, like putting on really good swimsuits make me feel so much more confident and beautiful in my body. Okay, next one. Even if the sky is falling. You guys, this one is amazing too. I mean, look. All white has always been a vibe, especially for the pool when you have a tan. Your tan looks so good with white. I love how this one kind of just like lifts my boobs up. I'm also in a size medium in all of this. Though I do wish this was a little bit more high-waisted, I'm not mad about that. Kind of cheeky on the butt, I'd say. And definitely shave down there because these can really like give you a good V-line shave. Constantly worried because I have not shaved yet, so. Hope I'm not uh, showing too much today. But look at this. Okay, girl, let's get a YouTube thumbnail. Wow, I look so good in these. Okay, remember when I was showing you guys a haul of this one and I was like, what is going on? I figured out this bathing suit. It is so scandalous, I feel so naked. It's so weird how after getting older, I'm so much more prude about like showing skin. Like this is a thong. I am uncomfortable showing my butt cheeks like that. Honestly, it's really, really cute. I feel super sexy, like maybe a little too sexy just for my vibes right now. Maybe I'm just not confident enough yet, but it is super cute. And I think the coverall is like, I, I'm gonna walk around like this, you know? <laughs> All right, you guys, this is the last one. I don't have matching bottoms. I, I guess I didn't buy matching bottoms. Wow, scandalous. But so cute. I actually really like the underwire because it gives me support on my like heavy big boobs. This feels like it's too small, but it actually fits. And I, on a scale of one to 10, like, do I like it? Oh yeah, I like it. I just think I need to find some high-waisted bottoms. And there we have it. Here is my Shein, Shein bikini haul. I 
finally did it been putting off for so long because i haven't felt felt confident enough but honestly this little exercise made me feel so much more confident in my body i feel so sexy i feel so beautiful and i am now like really just used to this being my new body so yeah nine months postpartum look like no more stretch marks in the belly area and i don't have the linea negra anymore see no more line here it's really just the extra baby weight that i haven't worked out and lost um but i'm sure if i put effort into it if i want to i shouldn't have anything to worry about it's all mental right now i hope you guys enjoyed this little segment and that will be it for today's vlog i just heard leo and dub come back home and dub was napping so um i'll see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching bye Mwah.